<laughs> Look at you! The most miserable collection of loser ghouls and incompetent monsters I've seen in my entire afterlife! Bad girl! Drop it! Drop it! <laughs> so I'm sure you're all wondering why I'm doing a happy dance. Because your incompetence forced me to hire an outside contractor to deal with the back problem. At no small expense to me, I might add. Oh. <laughs> Which reminds me, it is time to go to Dr. Peckenstein's castle to see what kind of pack-destroying monster he has created for us. Whee! <laughs> I don't care what it looks like, as long as it rids us of the lemon menace forever! We've got to help my poor Packums before it's too late! The pack is back! Chomping at his feet, Pack's our hero. Pack just can't be beat. Yeah! Pack and yellow, Pack and green. He's a challenge down machine. Yup, monster rules, and only one can stop him. The pack is back. Goes chomping at his feet. Pack's our hero. Pack just can't be beat. The pack is back. Oh, it's too late for you, Pac-Man. I've done it. Your perfect body is mine to control. What have you done to me, Dr. Packenstein? No. Were you snoozing when I explained this before? I pulled the old switcheroo. My brain, your body, your brain, my jaw. This must be a nightmare. I gotta pinch myself. Good luck with no hands. I do hope you enjoy your life of confinement more than I did. Oh, and have someone change the nutrient fluid once in a while? It gets pretty funky in there. I know I haven't eaten in ages, but I've never been so ravenously hungry before. This year, I've stocked the tables with enough food for an army. Or hopefully one Pac-Man and my guests. But I wonder why Pac's not here yet. <gasps> Everybody always wears the same thing, even me. I wish somebody would bring it to the party this year. Uh, oh, okay. Waking up in jail after a party is never a good sign. I'm pretty sure this isn't a party. We've been duped by that nasty brain, and I'm seriously worried about Pat. You should be! Ah! <sighs> you think we get used to that by now? What are you guys doing here? <sighs> the usual. Saving the lemon drops bacon, but Treyas and Dr. Packenstein are in cahoots. That explains why that nasty brain thought he recognized me when I was wearing this. We'd have gotten here sooner, but we didn't have the right address in Transylpactia. And the GPS signal is terrible out here. I'm lost. I'm frightened. Hold me. Oh. Let's go! We gotta save my Packums! I sure say that a lot. Um, excuse me. Solid flesh, real body? We can't go through the bars like you. <sighs> hey, there has to be at least one perk to not having a body anymore. A little to the left. Open sesame. Do try to keep up, sister. Oh, I'll do better than keeping up, Slowpoke. Cool. But how did... I remember Packenstein mentioning there were secret passages. What took you so long? Not bad for Packworlders. Hello, we won. But then who's keeping score? <coughs> Whatever! There's that conniving Cortex! What did you do to our pal, you lousy lobe? Yeah, spill your guts, you dirty brains! Uh, how would that even work? Whoa, take it easy, guys! It's me! That evil glob of gray matter somehow got my mind stuck in this jar, and his has taken over my body! <sighs> That makes a horrible kind of sense. Okay, yeah, but what I'm having trouble wrapping my head around is is how either of you talk without a mouth. I think it's some kind of telepathic thing. 
Whatever. We need to get my Packham's noodle back to where it belongs. ASAP. Right. Who knows how much trouble that guy can get my body into? My guess is plenty. Let's go. Um, guys, a little help here. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Okay, now let's go. Oh, this body is a marvel. So much better than my old one was, with its weakling, nerdy scientist limbs that could barely lift a lab beaker or fend off a wedgie. You are an embarrassment to appendages everywhere. Well, now I shall show all those wedgie givers and naysayers and fools who laughed behind my back. Now that I've got a back to laugh behind, soon all of Pack World will bow to me. I can hardly wait to meet my new mega monster. Or should I say, my prepaid satisfaction guaranteed Pack Pest destroying mega monster. Don't eat me! Eat Dr. Rumpen! I'm bitter and stringy, but he's plump and delicious! I'm not your enemy. Well, I am, but I'm not the enemy you think I am. Actually, I'm your worst nightmare of an enemy enemy. What's he babbling about? No idea. How many times do I have to explain this? I am Dr. Packenstein, and thanks to you slimy buffoons, I now possess Pac-Man's perfect body. Hmm, perfect, except that it's always ravenously hungry. I've never considered ghost a delicacy before, but like you said, you're delicious. Just him! I'm bitter and stringy, remember? Hmm. I can work with that. Oh, I can't believe that we're about to be gobbled by this double-crossing snake! Wait, wait! Okay, now I believe it. Look! There's my possessed packums! And there's my second course. Uh, hey, you know, guys, I don't think we thought this through. Even worse when it's not Pack doing the gobbling. Uh, you know, E Ghost, spooks are surprisingly tasty. And since I don't really need your extra set of hands, I might as well eat you too. <laughs> Unfortunately, those specters aren't very filling. They barely scratch the itch. Not enough body to them. <laughs> That this is even better than the spread at the roundhouse! Let's see what kind of feed bag old Spheros puts on before I gobble him along with his banquet. Oh, hey, road snacks. Ah! Uh. Oh well, guess there are some things even this awesome body can't stomach. Ah, get him! It's one of Packenstein's monsters! Ah, he barfed up that poor lady! He's eating everything inside! Tap that monster! Ooh, these look interesting. I wonder what they taste like. Ooh, cool mint. It froze our fire! Let's get out of here! Ah, just like stealing candy from a baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's Dr. Frankenstein! You created the belching yellow monster! Destroy that brain! Yeah, I'll destroy it! Oh, I really need to move to a quieter hood. I'm not that double crossing Dr. Brackenstein! And the monster is me! Well, him! Well, him inside of me! Uh, I mean. I'm not helping, am I? Pronoun trouble. Get get out! Out! Get away! Let's go, go! Well, I don't see how this Halloween could get any worse. Ugh, spiral. But you should really know better than to say that. Yeah. I really should. Great! We either get chopped or mobbed. I think you guys better power up. Still got your emergency berries, right? Yes, and this is definitely an emergency. 
I guess we have no other choice. Oh, just what I was afraid of. Spiral fly! Please, just don't let me turn into a... Oh, of course! <laughs> Looks better on me! Wow, and I wasn't feeling bad enough. Oh, sorry. Oh, hush! You guys think you can catch us? Think again! We caught you! <sighs> and now they've caught us! Yes, sir! Wish I could lend a hand, but I don't even have a mouth! So, why do I still think I'm hungry? Speaking of hungry... At least we could use our fairy powers to escape! It could be worse! This place, there's like a monster around every corner. Remind me to never visit Transylvania again. I will if we get out of here alive. Oh, yeah, oh, that itches. I despise the feeling of regenerating the ectoplasm. Oh, how odd! I cannot seem to perceive my depth perception. Mm. Clearly, as this confounded contraption is overdue for servicing. Okay, so we've been double-crossed by Dr. Packenstein. No big surprise. I've never met a mad scientist who wasn't a complete scoundrel. Oh, well, I... Uh, never mind. However, I do believe it will work out perfectly if we can get hold of the pack brat's brain and destroy it. He's stuck in a jar. So what can he do? You ring! Happy Halloween! What's up, Rodriguez? I command you, slimy specters, to follow Dr. Buttocks and hunt down the pack pest's bratty brain! <laughs> okay, I really, truly, for reals, don't know how things could get any worse. I cannot believe you just said that. Ugh, you know, every time you do, things get worse. Wow. That didn't take long. Obtains a brain! Silly, catch! Oh, uh, guys, I'm not a football! Good idea, Pat. Spiral, go long! My fourth is out of mouth! He's at the 30 yard, the 20 yard, he's at the 10! Touchdown! Head up! Brain ache! Ha <laughs> I did it! I did it! I did it! jar wasn't gross enough already. Okay, I'm not saying it, but I'm just saying. But you were thinking it. So here comes Count Pacula to make matters even worse. Get Look that! Look at that brain! Surrounded by ghosts, monsters, and villagers. And now here comes Count Pacula. Don't, Don't even, even think it! it! Come with me if you want to leave. I've always wanted to say that. Wait, you're saving us? I overheard you, Pac-Man. Any foe of Pakenstein is a friend of mine. Well, at least until I get even with the worst neighbor ever. I sleep days, work nights, and with all the lightning. <coughs> and screaming. I can see how that could be annoying. And angry villager storming his castle. <coughs> I can concentrate. If you can shut this guy up, I will be eternally grateful. And believe me, I know from eternity. Hey, what do you know? Things just got better. Now let's hope Dr. Packenstein isn't using my body to make other things worse. Ah, oh, President Spheros. 
Oh, finally! Pac-Man's here! Now we can get this party really jumping! Pac, my boy, I've been standing guard over your favorite foodstuffs, and they're all... Uh, mine! <laughs> More! <laughs> mm -hmm. Wigalicious! Oh, devil. <laughs> Crank it down a notch, lad! You're scaring the guests! You want scary? I'll show you scary! Oh, yes! I want to have the scariest Halloween party ever! Beth, my boy! Why are you talking funny? What's going on to you? The mind of a real genius, not an old quack like you. <laughs> I'm not monkeying around. Oh, what a disaster! This party couldn't get worse. Sure wish he hadn't said that. Recognize that yellow cerebellum anywhere. Pack my boy! If that's you in the jar, who commandeered your body? It was I, Dr. Parkinstein, the greatest scientific mind of our time. Actually, I'm the greatest, the greatest scientific, scientific mind, mind of our time. time. Whatever. Spiral, silly. Try to maintain some order here while Grinder and I subdue that body bandit. <laughs> maintain order? Seriously, dude? My God, please. Everyone, please remain calm. <laughs> calm? That guy must be bad. <laughs> <laughs> Catch me if you can, you substandard scientist. Oh, you ridiculous robber! I think I'm in love. Oh, this is an utter disaster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, the beautiful chaos I've caused. Revenge is sweeter than the sweetest Halloween candy. My tricks are a treat. Oh, whoa, sorry. Hack? <laughs> Hurry up with the jar, silly. Holding eyeballs is skeeving me out. Phew. Pack's brain's safe again. Not hardly, since I am about to destroy it permanently. Bitter end, Dr. Heiny Head. Taste the formidable fruity footsteps of the Peck na 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 na, -na. <laughs> to pop back to the lab to cobble together this mini brain transference device. It'll get Dr. Wackenstein's brain back in the jar and packs back in his body. I hope. Me too. Give it your best shot, Cersei. <laughs> it's on the eBay. Oh, well, that feels so funny. But this isn't funny. Ugh, and like this is, 
can't believe I'm in a Vampax body. No, no need to worry. I'll just recalibrate the frame stat on the doohickey and then... Now you need to worry. Well, it's nice to be out of that jar and in a body again. Even one as creepy as this. No offense, Count P. I brought your backup power berries. Take your pick, my boy. Thanks, Cersei. Down the pack hatch. <laughs> Smart berry. Not sure how that's gonna help me get my body back. Those berries never seem to work the same on normal pack worlders. And the count is even less normal. Hey, I'm right here. Words hurt, you know. That may be true, Count, but I'm afraid that Cylindria is correct. Observe, that brain is expanding with his intellect. Oh, of course. The solution, uh, is quite obvious. All that needs to be done to alleviate this threat is... Whoa! Whoa! I fall in head over heels for my lousy neighbor! Oh, this is the best day in my eternal life! Thank you, Pac-Man! Glad to be of service! Now I just need to solve the little matter of getting my giant gray matter back into my own body. You're right. I believe I've set the dials correctly. Everyone cross your fingers! Except for you, of course, Count. <laughs> Welcome back, Pac! Good to see all of you, bro! <sighs> it's good to be home. Hey, what happened to Dr. Packenstein's brain? Who can say? I must have dropped a decimal point when I was calibrating the crazy contraption. Ooh, this is just as bad as being in a jar. <laughs> Correction, it's worse. Um, no? Weirdest Halloween ever. 